Okay, we're going to fold an origami crane. You can start by writing a wish. You're going to take a square piece of paper. I have a pattern on one side and a solid color on the other side. Let's see if we can fix that. We're going to fold the paper in half so we get a rectangle. I'm going to open that up. I'll turn it 90 degrees. And I want to fold the paper in half again. Okay, I'm going to open that up. I'm going to put the paper so that the solid color is face down. I'm going to fold along the diagonal. We want to make sure that the paper lines up as close as possible. I'm going to open that up. I'm going to rotate my paper 90 degrees. And I'm going to fold along the other diagonal. And we make the nice crease. This will help us later in the crane. I like this next move. I'm going to put the there's a crease here. There's a mountain ridge. I'm going to press in the center and it pops up a little. We're going to take the two sides and bring them together and down. And the top is going to come down. You'll have a square that is one fourth the size of your starting square. So one more time. We press. We're going to bring these together, and we're going to go down to that. OK, we'll keep going. You'll notice we have an open end, and we have a closed end. The open end points towards us. I have this crease in the middle. I have this edge and I have this leaf on the left. I'm going to take the edge and fold it so it almost lines up with the center crease. Don't cross. All the way. And we're going to do that with the right top leaf. We're going to fold that to the center. Okay, we've got two of these. We're going to turn it over. We're going to do the same thing. Left top leaf. I'm going to fold that almost to the center line. And we're going to take the left, sorry, the right top leaf and put that to the center line. Okay. Um, this next move is going to help us. You see this triangle up at the top here? I'm going to fold forward and make a crease. I'm going to lift that up. And I'm going to go backwards also. And just pinch the paper. And I'll bring that up. The next move I call opening the mouth. We've got two sides here. We're going to do this move twice. I'm going to open the flaps and I'm going to take the and peel off the very top piece of paper. That's why we want the open side facing us so we can do this move. If it's closed, you just have to go back a couple steps. That crease where we made the triangle, well this is the back, this is the hinge. That's the back of the mouth and we see that this kind of looks like a mouth a little bit. Ka, 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 ka. Okay. We're going to, this one's a fun move. It's a little interesting. All the creases are there. We see a crease here. I'm just going to turn that crease so it goes, and I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to gently fold the paper. Origami means no 
cutting the paper, no tearing the paper, uh, and no tape either. So only folding the paper. So we have this. I'll do that one more time. So this comes down, and these close. So we had these two flaps, and we're going to open the flaps and take the top piece. And we want to basically kind of have it so it folds down. And we get this shape. Now I'm going to turn it over, and we're going to do the same thing to the other side. We have the back of the mouth is the fold where we have the where we did the triangle, so it's a helper move back there. All the folds already exist. You don't need to make new folds. You just kind of have to work with the paper a little bit. Okay. Um, now we've got some legs. Da, 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 da. We're going to go into the last stretch here. There's some folding uh, and then a couple other pieces. We have this edge. We have the center line. So again, this is on the side with the feet. We're going to, I call this, put on our skinny jeans. We're going to put on those uh, tight-fitting jeans. We're going to take this side and we're going to fold it almost to the center line. So we got that. We're going to take the other side the right top leaf, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to kind of fold that to the, we're going to fold that edge and bring it to the center, almost to the center. Don't cross the center. It'll make it harder in the future steps. Okay, we want to do the same thing to the, I'm just picking up the paper. We want to do the same thing to the other side. I have the left top leaf. I'm going to fold that. I have the right top leaf, and I'm going to fold that. Okay. And now we've got on our quote-unquote skinny jeans. Okay. The next stop, we, we want to get some ears. We're going to... You'll notice that you have two top leaves here and two on the other side. There's four leaves. I call these these things leaves. I don't know. Um, we're going to take the top two and put them together. And I'm going to hold those. And then I take the back two and I fold everything together. And now I have the ears. We're almost there. We're going to keep going. We're going to take the top bottom leaf or piece or tongue or whatever. We're going to fold that up. Uh, so it kind of touches the other two points. Same, same altitude, same height. I'm going to flip this over. We'll do the same thing on the back. I'm going to fold this up. I'm going to pinch this. Okay. Um, I'm going to look at the bottom here, and I see that I've got one, two, three, four. I've got these four leaves. Um, we're going to bring the top two and everything inside, and we're going to pinch it together, I'm pinching that top. And I'm going to hold that in the back. I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to fold those two big leaves and everything inside. This is a wing. We're going to fold this down all the way. We go to the other side. This is the other wing. We're going to fold that down. I'm going to lift those, and I see I got, I can hold on to this underneath the wings. Uh, these go too far straight up and down. I'm going to adjust this. I'm going to just kind of hold the bottom. I'm going to pull this forward. I'm going to kind of hold it, and then I'm going to pinch here the paper. And now it has an angle to it. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. I'm just going to take this. I'm going to bring it forward. I'm going to kind of pinch the paper at the bottom. The last thing we want to we want to choose one of these sides. You notice that it's folded. I'm going to do an inside fold. So I'm going to push this down 
and inside. So then I make the crease so that this is down and inside. It kind of goes down and inside, okay? And um, that's an origami crane that was first discovered or created uh, back in the 1600s in Japan. So I think that's pretty neat.